This thing's curling now, though, and it's... I would have to say it's probably on the ground, though. I mean, this thing is... Crazy strong. It's waiting for the velocities to update. I mean, to me, this looks like a tornado, even though we don't have anything clear there. Velocities are very strong. Wow. I'm gonna check my phone and see, because that, that's kind of glitching out a little bit. It's, it's not as strong as it might look. It is still... It's still strong rotation. Oh, actually, wait. It didn't update. Give me a second. It actually might be strong. But very tight velocities. Yeah, this is very tight rotation. So very tight rotation. Possibly a tornado heading towards Highway 2 in Nebraska. This is a classic-looking supercell. Classic-looking. What town? There aren't really many towns here, but uh, it's going to be going towards Highway 2. That's really the main location. There's like no major population centers in this area. Just east of Hyannis and west of Mullen. It's the closest locations to this. We don't have a debris signature yet where that rotation is. I, I'm just, I don't know how this isn't tornado warned. Like, it's, that's my thing. With how strong and tight that rotation is, I just don't know how this isn't a tornado warning. Even if it's not on the ground. Like, they've issued another severe thunderstorm warning. I, I'm, I don't know. This just, this feels like it should be a tornado warning. It's a crazy looking storm. Here's the latest radar scan. Got a crazy inflow. I mean, it's a classic looking supercell. There it is. Let's see what the velocities and all that show. Still no debris signature. Let's see what the velocity show. The uh, Oklahoma severe thunderstorm warning was just downgraded to 60 mile per hour winds, by the way. Wow. I mean, man, how is this not tornado warned? That rotation is tight as can be. Right along near, it's near Whitman. It's on North Whitman Road right now. Like, this could be either a, it could be possibly a strong and or large tornado. It's it's possible. I, I can't say that for sure because we don't really know. Um, but it very well might be. I, it's just, it's hard to tell because we don't have a debris signature. The velocities, though, are just very strong on this. They're tight as, I, it can't really get much stronger than that, unless there's some, some, something I'm missing here. But I don't think I'm missing anything. We're pretty close to the radar site. We could have a tornado on the ground north of the highway, too. We don't have a debris signature, as I mentioned. That doesn't mean we don't have a tornado. It just means that, you know, there might not be anything there. It might just be like an open field or something. We don't always get debris signatures with tornadoes, depending on where it is. But, I mean, that rotation, it can't get any stronger than this, really. I mean, it's tight as can be. I mean, look at my phone here. Look at that. It's another view of it. I... I, I don't know. If, if you're near Highway 2, avoid this area between Hyannis and Mullen in Nebraska. The only tornado warning that we have is the one in Illinois, which this one's done. That one's probably going to get canceled. I just, I don't know how that isn't warned. Got another one out here, too. With broad rotation north of Taylor in Nebraska. Uh, again, we might have an unwarned tornado going towards Whitman. If you're in Whitman, Nebraska... Get underground if you can. Get to your safe place. If you know any friends or family in this area, let them know. I mean, again, it's there's really very minimal roads here. I mean, it's probably people on Highway 2, and that's about it. I don't think there's really actually anybody that, like, lives here. There might be, like, a very low population in this area. So there aren't very many people, but if you know anybody that might be in this area, just make sure that they're aware of this, because there is possibly a... 
you know, a tornado on the ground here going towards Highway 2. Let's see if we have any traffic cams in this area. I don't know if we do, but I'm going to look real quick. There is a tornado possible tag on it, but like... I don't know if it's really possible at this point. I think it's likely or it is on the ground. I mean, <laughs> this looks like a tornado. I mean, we don't have a debris signature, but that that's a tornado. That's a huge that's a huge debris signature. Uh, unless this is not matched up, which I think this is a possibly a, a possibly a big tornado right now north of Whitman. You're in this warning. Again, get to your safe place. There, or just in the severe thunderstorm warning, get to your safe place. The the CC doesn't match up clearly with where the strongest couplet is, but I, there's a, still a pretty high chance that this is a tornado. It's not it's not matched up entirely, but I still think we have a pretty solid chance that there's a tornado here near Highway 2. Between Hyannis and Mullen in Nebraska. I, I don't know what to tell you guys. I This is like a textbook supercell, and this looks like a tornado to me. And unfortunately, we only can do so much. I mean, we can say, get to your safe place, but... There's probably people driving along Highway 2 that don't have any clue about this. We're gonna wait for another CC drop... ...update, just to verify. Because I can't verify just based off that, but I do think that this is a tornado. This is unwarned right now. Not warned, at least tornadic wise. Yeah. I mean, this is a tornado all day. That that's a tornado. The debris signature is there. We have very strong velocities. It's right where it would be. This isn't warned. Wow. I, this could be a large and strong tornado. I, I don't know if I'm missing something, but this is like clear as day right now on Highway 2. I'm... Unless I am missing something entirely, I don't know. Again, unless I'm missing something, I think that this is a tornado in Nebraska. I, every time we've seen something like this on radar this year, it has been a tornado. Unless there's some sort of crazy contamination, which there's no hailstorms nearby that are blocking our view of this. I don't think there's any other radar site we can even verify with. We're just in such a radar hole here. If you are in this area, I would again at least seek shelter. I I 
I am like 99.9% sure from everything that I have done for years now that this is a, a tornado that's actually probably large too and or strong. And there's nothing warned for this for some reason. I don't know if there's just a, maybe a communication issue, something like that maybe happening. Or they just, I don't know. I mean, they issued a warning on this not long ago for like a severe warning. That could be a big debris ball, for all what we know. Let me see what the CC shows. The latest reflectivity update has, if this is a tornado, I, this has to be a tornado. If you're in Whitman, get to your safe place near the Weir area. This thing is probably a large and strong tornado right now near Whitman. This debris signature is huge. This is a, I mean, this is a, this is a huge tornado. There's no other way to say this. There's no warning on this. If you're in Whitman, the Wire area, Duluth and Nebraska, you got to get to your safe place. I don't know why there's no warning on this. I've never had this happen on a live stream where we have no warning on something that looks this intense. I mean, the debris signature is huge near Highway 2. I've never been this frustrated. I, I, it's going, it's going into like the middle of nowhere, but there are people probably in here somewhere. Highway 2 is the main area. This debris signature is huge. I... I really don't know what to tell you guys. I, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, like, I, I there's no tornado warnings anymore, but this is on the ground. I... I Tweet it? I don't know what tweeting is really going to do here. I'll... Me... I'm just going to take an image of this. <sighs> this is a classic looking tornado. They have now just issued a confirmed tornado warning on this. That took way too long. This is an urgent alert. A tornado is on the ground. Seek shelter immediately. This is a confirmed tornado near Whitman, Nebraska. We've been talking about this for the longest time now, and I it just now got warned. It, that's just way too long it, it, this is a probably large and strong tornado too it's it's observed but uh, i think that this is large and strong if you're near whitman or near wire again get to your safe place away from windows lowest floor possible interior room of your home or building we've been talking about this for like 15 minutes there's a huge debris signature on this this could be a, a potentially intense tornado too with how strong that with how large that debris signature is these velocities are off the charts So it's moving south right now. So again, in Grant and Hooker counties, Nebraska. Should it be PDS? I mean, I don't know what to tell you guys anymore. I, it really should be, but I, I'm not the National Weather Service. I'm just, I'm telling you what we know here. And the entire time, this has looked like a huge tornado, and it still is. I mean, this debris signature is huge for whatever's in this area. I don't think there's really much here. But we have a massive debris signature. This on radar is just all debris on the reflectivity. This is a fully, it's getting close to a rain wrapped tornado now. It's probably very large and strong right now, uh, just out the highway too. <laughs> Let's see what it looks like in this area. The Whitman Cemetery probably just took a hit from this. There are people that live in Whitman, I'm pretty sure. There's a post office and there are actual homes there. I hope everybody in Whitman kn knew about this to some extent. This is Whitman. It's not a big town, but there are people that live here. And this tornado went right through Whitman, I'm pretty sure. <sighs> this is a... 
mon I mean, this is a very strong tornado right now on the south side of Whitman. Get underground if you can, if you're in the south side of Whitman. Um, again, in Nebraska. This is a, a big tornado producing probably some big-time damage to the areas near Whitman, Nebraska. This is... I mean, the debris signature is going through the values that you can even have on radar. I, this is potentially a... a catastrophic tornado with how significant that is we have not had something like this since like the oklahoma tornado that which was back over a month ago even connor's posting about it now i it's just inexcusable in my opinion I, i'm not usually one to say anything about that but like this is unwarranted for way too long and we had a very clear view of this for several scans in a row this is a this is probably a monster tornado right now ripping through a pretty rural field but there are some homes along here on these roadways that are just south of Whitman Nebraska yeah. 